Well, here we go, people. I don't know, maybe about a month of, uh, not of work, of constant, but of when I could find the time. Uh, built the drum riser with Tim Sway, from Tim Sway Perspective, as you'll see. Um, the front of these boxes is covered with spandex. Um, you'll see how that's done. Bunch of LED tape lighting everywhere. Uh, took the sign, Chet ordered a sign, we cut it into three, and I made some shadow boxes for it. So we could run some LED lighting around it. Uh, I can change the colors on those to whatever I want. And we have uh, four LED par cans, two under the stage, two on top, shooting at the drums. Have some LED tape light inside my acrylic drum. I just wanted to give you a little idea of the color changes. When I go to the white, it blows everything out. So I didn't do that to show this to you. But uh, there's tons of colors for this. Thanks for watching. Everything from here on is going backwards in time. See you guys, Wild Ones Rock. All right, y'all, so I'm up early this morning. Well, nine o'clock, that's, that's rock and roll early. That's rock and roll real early. So I'm driving over to the maestro Tim Sway's house from Tim Sway Perspectives, and we're gonna build us a drum riser. It's about 35 degrees out right now with, I don't know, two and a half feet of snow on the ground. But that ain't stopping us. Wild ones, peace out. So where is the stripper pole going now on this platform? Dead center. Nice. So here we are, we figured out a way to keep the front exposed for lighting, so we're going to strip it. I wish I could get out, I wish I could see the world, and I know it sounds cliche to say that my head is in the world, I'm choking on the same air that used to breathe a dream, the town that steals my soul away, and the girl like you. Safety first, guys. Safety first. I'm